The hero that Mini used to conceal a troll pick has finally been upgraded, and now he's ready to steal your buff. Hey guys, in case you didn't read the last update, Hanzo has been super buff, and now he can cast his ultimate more frequently, and his movement speed has been greatly increased while he's ulting. These are my builds. And this is how I set up the emblem. This spell I'm using Petrify, because you can easily get on top of the enemies and petrify many targets. At the start of the game, I will suggest buying the boots first, because you want to get their buff quickly and retreat fast. Tell your teammates to help you steal their buff, it's extremely easy with Hanzo. The enemies decided to not even bother to keep attacking the red buff, which was the right choice since it would have been futile anyway. Nobody can stop Hanzo from stealing your buff. Just by using your presence, sometimes it can scare the enemies away. Poor Harif got executed by the buff. I thought my second skill was enough to help him take it. When ulting, make sure to do it from a safe distance. Also, when casting a second skill, try to aim it a little bit further back where you think the enemies are going to go. You can cancel the second skill by moving, attacking, or using a skill. They also changed this part, it wasn't like that before. I think they forgot to mention this change in the update. By the way, rewatching this video, I realized that the countdown for the buff starts right after you steal it. So you can see that I still have the red buff, but the enemy's red buff has respawned already. I was a bit surprised. Whenever you see that you have failed a gank or can do anything else, recall back to your body right away. You don't want to waste demon souls for no reason. Well, there was absolutely nothing I could have done there. It was a 3v2 situation and I am Hanzo. They're starting to blame already. It's normal when you're playing solo, so don't let the chat distract you. As you probably know, I almost never text during the game, unless I die, or there's something important that I have to tell my teammates, because my eyes are too busy looking at the map, while in my head I'm thinking if I should push, when I can steal the enemy's buff, and so on. No time to waste typing.
Once again, I'm imposing my presence and just pretending I'm going to do something, but we know that Hanzo cannot do much when he doesn't have his ultimate. Just waiting for my ultimate. At this point, I'm not sure why my team keep complaining, since we are actually winning. I thought Sho already used his kick on either Joehead or Harif, because they killed those two. The problem that we're going to face is that our marksman doesn't really have too much experience in the game, so she will often be out of position and dies first. I saw that 4 of the enemies are in the top lane, and their blue buff is up, so let's attack the small camp first to unlock my first skill to steal. Okay, at this point my mentality shifted. I realized that the marksman doesn't know what are her priorities, so I decided to become the carry role instead. Just farm and split push while the enemies are distracted. But Cho had the same idea. You can use the ultimate to escape. This one will allow you to teleport to your soul instead. And remember that your soul can go through walls. I knew I couldn't survive that one, so I decided to farm and clear the minion way first, before dying. It's all about efficiency. As you can see, we are off to a rocky start, but soon you will see how Hanzo can change the tide of battle, trust me. Here it's obvious that the enemies are coming to gank the bottom lane, but unfortunately our marksman has no map awareness at all. I will still see if I can help her in any way since she's our marksman and is one of the most important roles in the late game. Unfortunately that didn't go well, and this is where we lose the game. Just kidding. We 
We could have taken the Lord, since there were three enemies dead, but with our marksmen, there's no way. I know that at this point, a lot of you guys will have been trash talking the Leslie nonstop, but instead try to focus that energy to think about how you can actually carry and win the game. When Henzo is fed, you can kill their carries almost instantly, so always try your best to aim their backline first. Leslie died and we wasted the Lord. My team's still doing some very silly mistakes, like trying to fight them when we're outnumbered. Just keep your composure and never try to fight without your ultimate. It seems like Franco cannot hook the main body. He does damage but he doesn't pull it. Let's try to farm Demon Souls as quickly as possible since I don't have any left. Then I can help my teammate. Since my HP is quite low, Herif should be tanking the Lord with his unlimited shields. Just pointing this out so in the future if you are in this Herif's position, you will know what to do. I'm telling my teammates to not waste the Lord this time. Let's try not to do the same mistake twice.
Here I wanted to catch someone off guard who is trying to defend the Lord. But once I saw that our Jawhead got hooked in the middle lane, I decided to go help him. But to be honest, my team should be pushing with the Lord instead. It's really hard to focus on the main screen and at the same time on the minimap when you're in a team fight. I'm telling Jawhead how we should proceed in the next team fight. Since Hanzo can kill their backline almost instantly, we just need Grog to initiate the fight and Jawhead take care of the Cho. That will solve most of the issues. As you can see, I can instantly kill their marksman. All I need is a little bit of distraction from my teammate. This game was absolutely a roller coaster, but I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hey guys, I have decided to do a weekly skin giveaway because you guys have been amazing and I truly appreciate that. The price is 900 diamonds worth a giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe and leave a comment, and I will randomly choose one. If you are selected, I will send you a direct message. But please don't leave your ID or the skin you want, because I won't be picking those. Thanks and best of luck.